Hello, and, Hello and welcome to the presentation of Profinet for machine building. Communication between individual modules in this machine is based on Ethernet, which is why Profinet is suitable for both local and global networking. The open architecture of the Profinet Ethernet standard enables IP communication beyond the boundaries of local area networks. This offers you a series of benefits including optimal machine servicing and quick troubleshooting, validation of diagnostics data in the Profinet network with the help of the TIA portal, and diagnostics of the entire machine over vast distances per remote access with our management platform Cinema Remote Connect. Today we would like to use this machine to show you how remote maintenance work can be handled in practice. Right now we can see on the machine's HMI that the error counter for the camera is increasing. I'll now have this checked and remedied by a remote maintenance expert. Dominic, we're experiencing a problem with the Sematic MV420 camera on this machine. The error rate when reading the work pieces is increasing, which lowers throughput and productivity. What could be the cause? To precisely diagnose the fault, I'll connect to the machine via remote access. Please initiate remote access for this operation. Okay, will do. I'm now stopping the machine and activating remote access with the key operated switch. According to the applicable security rules, the tunnel is now being set up from the inside to the outside, or in other words, from the VPN router in the machine to the server. In our case, the service technician authenticates himself via two factors, smart card and password. Okay, I'm now launching the Cinema Remote Connect client and connecting to the remote maintenance server. Which machine is affected? The central module system component. Okay, I'm connecting now. Could you also give me the IP address of the camera? In the Profinet topology, I see the IP 192.168.21.22. Okay, I'm connecting to the camera's web-based management. Please give me the password for the service user. The password for the service user is... I'll take a look at the error cache. Okay, there are several reading errors. Let me just switch over to the diagnostics images. It appears as if the surface of the workpiece has changed, so the exposure is no longer correct. But that's not a problem. The MV420 can also handle changes in exposure. I'll quickly make the adjustment. Direct remote access eliminates the need for elaborate copying and sending of project and image data via email not to mention on-site service calls. The problems are solved directly in the system. So let's see how far along our service technician is. I have now adjusted the exposure settings. We'll perform a few random tests in manual mode for good measure. It's looking good. The codes are all identified at a high level of reading quality. That sounds great. I will now end the remote access. And switch back to automatic mode. Then I can also log off the server with my Cinema Remote Connect client. I'll just enter a brief comment in the logbook. Thank you, Dominic. In the Profinet diagnostics, I was able to see that the reading time is back to within the Profinet cycle time, and the system is producing error-free again. As you were able to see in this sample application, you can quickly remedy faults per remote maintenance using Cinema Remote Connect. Integrated Profinet diagnostics from Siemens as part of totally integrated automation ensure the highest level of productivity for your plant. Siemens. Ingenuity for life.